My name is Susanne Lilia Bukhart. I work in uh, Copenhagen, and we are about to enter the subsurface part of East Grip Camp, where the ice core drilling takes place. Come along! <laughs> we are going down quite deep because this project has been running for a while, and since then a lot of snow has compiled uh, on top of it. So every year we have to go deeper to get into our trenches. Welcome to the East Grip Drill Trench, where the deep ice core has been drilled. You can also see that the ceiling is very low. Over the years, the ceilings come down and the floor comes up due to the pressure of the surrounding ice. Yeah, at this place, the ice sheet is about 2,670 meters thick. And we've drilled from the top and all the way to the bottom here by taking up ice cores three, three and a half meters of length at a time. The project started in 2016 and the bedrock was reached in 2023. Let's see the drill. So now the drill is up at, at the surface and it's tilted to a horizontal position. Over here at the end, you can see a wheel. That's the top wheel. When the ice core drill is operating, the whole thing is turning turn to, to the vertical, you have the wheel at the top where the cable goes over. We have motor sections and electronics um, so that we can communicate with the drill while it's in the borehole. We can see the top of the borehole. It's closed with a round lid so that we don't get stuff into the borehole that we don't want. It's difficult to fish things up from 2,670 meters. <laughs> over on the side, the white cabin, it's a freezer. But here it's used the other way around. It used to keep the drillers warm while drilling. So that's where the drill operator will sit when we're drilling and keeping an eye on how things are going. You can see that we have three cutters sitting around the core barrel. And when the drill is rotated, the skate section holds is still and the lower part of the drill is rotating, digging its way into the ice, collecting an ice core inside this uh, barrel that we have here. And what's special about this site is that it is located in what we call an ice stream. And an ice stream is a part of an ice sheet where the ice moves faster towards the coast than elsewhere in the ice sheet. And it's important for future sea level estimates that we understand the, the flow of ice in, in this ice stream feature. Thanks for coming on the tour. <laughs>